Today we're going to talk about uranium and not just any uranium but fission 3.0. Dev, let's just hit the ground running. Uranium is an absolutely hot market period. I don't care what's happening with market rebalancing, reconfiguration or anything else. This is the sector to be looking at. So why don't we start there? What do you think? Absolutely. It's odd that the fundamentals today are better than ever. I don't remember in my all my years where the Democrats were pro-uranium. I don't remember ever where people who are the green energy people now saying, yes, we need nuclear power. Um, on the front page of a major German magazine, well, they need nuclear because they run out, they're using coal. They've run out of energy. So I've never seen the fundamentals ever better since I got back. I started the business, you know, 30 odd years ago. And, but, you know, markets are irrational. To, you know, we know that. So that's what's going on. But the fundamentals are amazing right now. Spot prices, the stocks are, when the, well, uranium was around $30, stocks were about there. Now uranium's here and the stocks are still back there. It shows you how, but the problem is they're selling everything. Market people just want to go to cash. Well, I hear you, I hear you, but there's just too much bloody money out there. And the difference between now and 2008 is there's a lot more money and it's got to go somewhere and, and crypto's not looking very friendly. So um, let's talk about the benefits of why, for those of you out there seeking to be one of those one in 10 that are going to rise no matter what, why Vision 3.0, what are some of the competitive reasons why you should be on your watch list. Like, let's talk about your track record. Let's start there. I'm going to direct you here. <laughs> well, I think number one, and they say in real estate's location, location. I say in junior companies, management, management, management. And we're, first of all, well-funded. We have $14 million in the bank. We're going to spend $8 million over the next few months alone. So there's lots of news coming, potentially. Um, it, oh, and, and we have a, a collection of properties that we've collected in a bear market ready for this. We have a great... Uh, joint venture partner traction, they're spending money. So you're looking for management with track record. We have the guys who found the Waterbury discovery and was sold to the Koreans, which eventually went to Lucas Landin. We have the, you know, the Triple R, which is, is a world-class project that Ross and the guys are doing. So when you have people who've done it before, uh, it makes you comfortable, okay, there are certain things we're looking for for deposit. So I say Fission 3 is not only the uranium business, but it also has the upside, if we hit a, a discovery, the stock will double more. So it's a, it's a you own, the, own stocks where the people have also have their own money in it. Every financing, I've always put money in, at least 100,000. So, and I'm always a buyer in the open market, and I'm not a seller. So if you're looking for stocks, you've got to look for people with the management, well-funded, good projects. And I think we tick all those boxes. So what's happening with the uranium market right now? I mean, there are, what, what are your thoughts? Well, I mean, and the spot price is doing well. Um, I think finally last week, the, the U.S. said, hey, anything to do with Russia, whether it's enrichment or et cetera, no more. So it's a huge opportunity for North America, especially Canada, right? Um, so you're seeing not only it's, it's a green energy, that's number one, and number two, I don't know how long this Russian-Ukraine uh, war will go on, or invasion, I should say. Um, that's going to impact U.S. companies because they need the uranium from somewhere. So they can, you have to keep in mind, in America, f every fifth household is uh, literally fueled by uranium, right? That's without nuclear power, they can turn the lights on. Every tenth household is powered by Russian uranium. So... Where is it going to come from? And it's a very tight market. So I believe when you start to see producers starting to contract this fall, you can see a great spike in the price of uranium, which only helps all of us. So, Dev, talk to me about what should Fission 3.0 shareholders, what should we expect this year? I mean, in addition to, you know, you talk about management, you got the management, you got the exploration play. Where are we with the deal? Well, good. We, you know, we're gonna we're spending eight million dollars this summer. That's a lot of money. Even when we were running fishing uranium, we ran ten. So this year, will be two, over twelve and a half million going in the ground. And we've been getting good news. You know, we got we got some pretty good results on Lazy Edward. Uh, but there's two or three other projects we're gonna do, Bird and a few others that we're drilling. So if you want to be in, you want people. An exploration company should be exploring, and that's what we're doing. Twelve and a half million dollars is a lot of money. We were very fortunate that we took the money when we did. We took the money in December, 
and we're well funded. I would not want to be an exploration company right now looking for money. Well, there you go. For those of you out there, track record management and uranium. Thank you. Thank you.